Hey guys, it's your girl Ashley here, and I'm here with a updated uh, bookshelf tour. Um, I rearranged my bookshelf and put it somewhere else, and just wanted to do a quick little review. There it is. Uh, the the second shelf and the bottom and the third shelf are not mine. That's my fiance's. So, um, on the top we have ducks because I like to collect. I have very lot a lot of ducks. This one's special because it says my name Ashley on it. And then I got this one, it's a celebrity duck, it's Dorothy. Um, and then when we come down here, we have the Green Lantern, little guy I put up there, um, a penguin, well, an owl, a penguin that lights up, my mom got me, and another duck. Um, so let's just take these down real quick. Um, and that stuff, okay. And we have, I just rearranged it um, yesterday, so I've tried to put series together and different stuff like that, but I have so many, it's kind of hard. Um, we have The Level 26 by Anthony E. Zyker. Love this book. Um, the second one, Stark Prophecy, Divergent by Veronica Roth, Insurgent by Veronica Roth, and Allegiant should be right here soon, next week. So excited. Wither by Lauren Stefano. Fever by Lauren De Stefano, Lockdown Escape from the Furnace by Alexander Grand Alexander Gordon Smith, and Solitary by Alexander Gordon Smith, Enclave or Enclave from Anne Anne Agar. Agar. Uh, on the top here we have the kidnapping of Christina Lattimore and Scott Westerfield's Pretties. I don't like this cover. Um, I want to get the other one, but I just got that because it's at Savers for cheap. Cinder by Marissa Meyer. I love this book. I need to get Scarlet, but I'm waiting for it to come out in paperback because I want it to match. Um, and then we have by L.J. Smith, Night World 1, Night World 2, and Night World 3. Don't want everything to fall over, sorry. <laughs> Buffy the Vampire Slayer, Volumes 1. And volume two. I need to find my third one. Volume one of Christopher Pike's Thirst. Abducted by T.R. Reagan. I love this book. And Scott Westerfield's Uglies. Sorry if my book is all going to fall over. Okay. Now, second shelf. We have a Homer Simpson toy that I got at Burger King. Um, I thought it was cute, so I just put them on there. And then we have my book, oh, an owl. Oops, another angel. My mom got me that. And a Nook book light, back when I had the Nook. And then we have, up top we have Anne Rice, The Claiming of Sleeping Beauty, Book Thief, Wake, The Adortion of Jenna Fox, Killing Brittany, and The Witch, A New Beginning by L.S. Gannon. Love that book. Um, then we have The Pawn by Steve James. The Knife of Never Letting Go by Patrick Ness. Gone by Michael Grant. Summonings by Kelly Armstrong. I got that, I haven't read it yet. Vampire Academy from Michelle Mead. We have Vampire Academy, Frostbite, and Shadow Kiss. I need to get the rest of it. Uh, Jennifer L. Armentrow, Obsidian. I was kind of mad when this came to me because it was kind of bent from Amazon. So it's kind of a little mad. Susan's E.E. E. Angel Fall. I love this book. Cannot wait for the second one. Neil Schusterman. I'm sorry. Unwind. Trying to do this with one hand, which isn't really working out that great. Uh, Ruby Red by Kristen Gear. Again from Amazon. Black Cat by Holly Black. White Cat from Holly Black, not White Cat. White, white Cat from Holly Black. Whew, excuse me. Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lainey Taylor. Lee Bardugo, Shadow and Bones. Uh, Sarah J. Moss, Throne of Glass. Paper Towns by John Green. It's kind of getting hard for me to pull these out. That's why I'm showing you this way. Hold Me Close to Necromancer. A Great and Tellerable Beauty by Libra Bray. I love Libra Bray. I haven't read this one yet, though. Allison Hewitt is Trapped. Anna Dressed in Blood. I haven't finished that one yet. If I Stay. Graceling. And oops, The Last Apprentice, Revenge of the Witch, the first one. 
And then the third shelf is where I put my bookmarks. I have a lot of bookmarks in there. Um, and then we have some two more ducks. One's a cat. And this is my to be read jar. And then up here we have Jenny McCarthy belly, belly laughs. Uh, Ruta, oh, sorry, The Reliable Wife, that down there, and Between Shades of Grey. And then we have City of Ash by Cassandra, Cl Chris Cassandra Clare. Yeah, I can't talk today. And then we have, I move this up here, Diviners by Libra Bray. I actually, this is the first like 500 page book I actually finished. I love this book, it was so good. And then we have The Magicians by Liv Grossman. Tiger Curse by Colleen Hook. Across the Universe by Beth Revis. The Internal Ones by Kristen Miller. Lovely Bones by Allison, Alice Siebold. And The Almost Moon by her. Catching Fire by Susan Collins. Delirium by Lauren Oliver. Up there. Hex Hall by Rachel Hawkins. The Girl of Fire and Thorns by Ray Carson. The Fault in Our Stars by John Green. J. Bond sung something. Perfect Victim. Maureen Johnson, 13 Little Blue Envelopes. Gone Girl by Jillian Flynn. Unbreakable by Cami Garcia. Read this book already and love it. The Duff, The Designated Ugly Fat Friend by Kopi Kepler. Night Circus by Erin Morgenstern. And The Vampire Diaries by L.J. Smith. Now, if we go down to the shelf here, which this is the only one that is mine currently. Um, the second shelf is my fiance's. Like I said, he has like the Mark series and um, R.L. Stein stuff. But up here we have oh, honey, um, The Thoughts That Can Change Your Life by Susie Orman. Love that book. William and Kate. Charlene Harris, Dead Reckoning. Kendra Wilkinson, Sliding Into Home. The Candy Shop Wars by Brandon Mill. I actually got this for my friend. I have to send it to her. I Am Number Four. Artichoke Hearts. Hush Hush and Crescendo. Beautiful Creatures by Cami Garcia and Margaret Stuhl. And I have to say, I actually did not like this book. But I loved Cami Garcia's book she did by herself. I haven't read Margaret Stuhl's book yet by herself, but that. Um, the Middle of Confessions, The Private School Murders from James Patterson. I'm reading this book right now and loving it. Um, then we have Mary with Zombies. I need to get the rest of those. Then we have Rotten Ruin by Jonathan Mayberry. I have not read this, but my fiance's read it, and he said it was really good. And I kind of have like a green scheme going over here. Uh, Susie, Susan, Sue Grafton, A is for Alibi. Ali Condi matched and James Dashner, the mage runner. I've read a couple pages of this and keep putting it back, but I want to read it. James Patterson, Witch and Wizards, The Replacement. Sorry, replacement. Dead and Loving It. Fifty Shades of Grey, the first one and the second one. James Patterson, First to Die. Sex, Murder, and a Double Latte. Numbers. And Percy Jackson, The Lightning Thief. And here I have Don't Sweat This. Come on, get down, go. Don't Sweat the Small Stuff. And then these are my paperback, my mass produced paperbacks. We have Dial C for Chihuahua, Sleeping Beauty, Tammy Ho, G Guilty as Sin. And then all these are all Charlene Harris's. We have Dead Until Dark, Living Dead in Dallas, Club Dead, Dead to the World, Dead as a Doornail, Altogether Dead, From Dead to Worse, and Dead in the Family. I think I'm missing. Like a couple more. And then like I said down here we have the Mark series by PC Cass and Kristen Cass. Goosebump books. I have a Stephen King book in there somewhere. My little book I made for my dog. Some more contemporary books done because he likes contemporary. Um, and that is my bookshelf tour. Hope you guys like it. Um, if you have any questions or comments please comment below. Um, and just live life and read. All right, guys. If you have any recommendations for me, please leave them down below. All right, guys. Bye.